Good morning, friends. Sarah East here for popcrunch.com. So I woke up this morning and a filling fell out, and it got me to thinking about Chris Brown. And um, so I checked, and, and of course he was on Larry King the other night um, about the whole domestic violence thing. Anyway, um, now it's come out that he's really upset with Oprah. Yeah, because apparently um, he's hurt by her not being more compassionate to his situation. First of all, it's a little funny that he's hurt by something. It doesn't matter. Um, anyway, but I kind of think he's right. I mean, she did this whole show about domestic violence and, and didn't really show his side of things when it comes to domestic violence. And, you know, I just feel like it's a little hypocritical, you know, for her to turn on him so quick when they were like besties or whatever. And I thought, you know, like, did we turn on Oprah when she promised that she was going to stay skinny and then she totally turned into a cow? No, we didn't. Did we turn on Oprah when she forced us to read A Million Little Pieces, that book by James Fry, and then totally outed James Fry as being a fraud on her show? By the way, that's a really good book. I don't care what anybody says. No, we didn't turn on her. Did we turn on her when she opened a school for girls in South Africa and then the school later turned into this sexual abuse amusement park? It was all like, oh, miss, I'd like to ride the Ferris wheel. Okay, Susie, but remember, you must be this tall to ride. No, we didn't turn on her after all that because we're loyal. And Chris Brown expects the same loyalty out of her. And is that so much to ask? I mean, okay, you know, like, he apologized. And sure, maybe he can't form a complete sentence. And, and yeah, okay, maybe he didn't do any real time in jail for his crime. But listen, oh dog, Oprah, he wore a baby blue sweater and bow tie on Larry King. And if that doesn't scream, I'm sorry. I don't know what does. Or maybe I'm way off on this. You guys tell me, are we still mad at Chris Brown? Are we over it? I mean... Rihanna got that, that good uh, cover girl deal out of it with the concealer. I mean, I'm just saying, I think good things have happened for everyone. So I think now is the time that we should go back to, you know, not buying Chris Brown's records anyway. Let me know what you guys think. And hey, don't forget to check out popcrunch.com for all the latest in celebrity gossip news and videos.